our enemies today are even more willing than the Nazis or fascists were to kill innocent civilian Americans here in our homeland. Our enemies today are stateless actors who don't wear uniforms and who plot against Americans abroad and here in the United States, specifically targeting civilians in violation of the laws of war. The bill we're introducing today, the Terrorist Expatriation Act, would simply update the 1940 law to account for the enemy that we are fighting today. Under the Terrorist Expatriation Act, the State Department would be able to revoke the citizenship of an American who affiliates with a foreign terrorist organization uh, or fights or who fights against our country. And foreign terrorist organizations, uh, as uh, you're probably aware, are, are also designated according to statute by the State Department. That law, which is 18 U.S.C. Section 1481, was upheld as constitutional by the Supreme Court of the United States in 1980 in a case called Vance versus Terrazas. This isn't, a, as, as, as the Senator pointed out, this isn't a knee-jerk reaction. It reflects the changing nature of war in recent events. And, and war has moved into a new dimension. Uh, individuals who pick up arms, this is what I believe, have effectively denounced their citizenship. And this legislation uh, simply memorializes that effort. So somebody who wants to burn their, their passport, well, let's help them along. 